If you caught my previous video, I opened up one half of my very first Paldea Evolved booster box. Now, unfortunately that day, I was running short on time, didn't have a chance to finish all 36 packs. But in today's video, we're gonna continue our lucky streak fingers crossed, and open up the rest of the packs in this video. Now, if you caught that first video, you know that we did pretty dang good for only opening up 18 packs, so hopefully our lucky streak can carry on and continue today. But let's not waste any more time. What's up, guys? Welcome to the channel. Let's dive right into this in today's video. Alrighty, so here we go right here, opening up the second half of this booster box. Like I said, we're going to be opening up 18 packs. If you didn't catch that first video, what are you doing? Pause this one, go check that out, because the very first pack that we opened was an absolute banger of a hit. Now, hopefully we can continue our lucky streak here and just keep going, getting a ton of good hits, good pulls in this video. But we're not trying to waste any time in today's video. We want to get right into it, because with the luck that I had yesterday, hopefully we continue and just get some absolutely gangster, gangster pulls. Whooper, ooh, Paldane, Whooper, Reverse, and a Rabska, Reverse, or re Regular, Rare, geez. Already starting this one minute into this video, one pack, I'm already slurring my words. Man, I don't know why lately, just not doing too good on the camera. But, um, yeah, anyway, let's keep going. Like I said, we did get some great pulls. We got six good pulls for only 18 packs last time, which is pretty dang good odds if you ask me. I feel like I'm already doing better than the Scarlet and Violet base set, so hopefully we can continue that. Like I keep saying, Rookie D, Shrudel, and a Belly Boat EX, a Belly Bolt EX. Absolutely sick artwork, and like I said, hopefully we just continue these insane pull rates. Maybe I can finally be like all the other people on YouTube, getting insane pull rates on my first boosted box in the title and stuff like that. But like I said, hopefully... I'm not trying to get my hopes up, but I am really excited with where we're at on this booster box so far. And we're only, what, 11 packs in right now? This is the 11th one in my hand. So hopefully Vesper Queen Reverse, Watchful Reverse, and a Slacking Regular Rare Hollow. Not too bad, not too exciting, but like I said, we did do really good on the first half. So even if we only get like one or two on this one, we still did actually, if we get four in this second half of this i'll be super happy anything over that will be absolutely cake i'll be ecstatic the dunsparce gotharita secret rare right there wow we are absolutely killing it anything behind it just a regular veluza rare hollow but veluza is one of my go-to pokemon on my playthrough but the gotharita secret rare right there absolutely gangster for a second pull here we're only like what a third a fraction of the way in so dang hopefully we start just getting absolutely way luckier than i did on the scarlet and violet base that i keep saying that but i just really feel like i just i don't know i just did not get any good pulls i feel like i had to buy or i actually bought a bunch of them picked them up today but I still have to get a bunch more because I just, like I said, did not get a ton of secret rares. Garnacle right there, one of the new Pokemon. Kind of cool. like that idea. like the concept on that one. But if you didn't know, I tried to open all of these from the bottom. I don't know why I did that on just coincidentally on the first couple of packs. And now that I noticed it and I have a pattern and all the open packs are done the same way, I have to do it that way. Or else, I don't, I'm, I guess nothing will happen, but it just makes me happy to know that I'm doing it all organized in the same way every time. Raichu Reverse, Fighting, not even going to try to pronounce that, in a Luxray Hollow. Is anybody else kind of sick of Luxray? I don't know, I played through a bunch of games all at once leading up to Scarlet and Violet release day. And for some reason, I'm just kind of sick of Luxray. Is that bad to admit? I don't know, I'm kind of sick of Charizard, Charmander, and just that whole lineup as well. I mean, I know the whole Obsidian Flame thing's coming out next, but damn, they just want to throw Charizard down our throats at this point, which, I mean, I get it, it's like Pikachu, but still. Anyway, we're not going to keep ranting about that. Hariyama, regular rare, right there as I drop it. Cool, cool artwork. Like I said in the previous video, the artwork, I feel like, has really stepped up on this second set. I know other people mention that, that they do that. As the sets go, the artwork gets better and better. And like I said, I, this is my first time really opening cards 
in 20 years or it actually is my first time opening and collecting cards in 20 years so i'm not used to these like different expansion sets geez why can i get this out but um yeah i'm not used to this like different expansion sets and stuff like that these cards just straight up don't want to come out of this but um yeah like i was saying they really did step up the artwork on even just like the regular commons and uncommons and rares and stuff like that like look at that artwork absolutely cool graffiti New Pokemon, absolutely love that one too. Swellus, Mastiff Reverse, Mouse Hold Reverse, and an Abominus Note regular rare. Like I said, guys, earlier, if we get probably two more hits for a total of 10 on this booster box, I guess I'll be pretty happy. Obviously, we want to get as many as we can. If I can get six on this round or this half of this booster box, that'd be absolutely sick. 12 hits on 36 packs would be absolutely incredible. Way better than I did on the last one, but let's see. Snover, Reverse, Palmy Reverse, and a Spirit Tomb regular rare right there. Oh, put that over there. Let's go. Soda Water Reverse, Taurus Reverse, and a Faulkner Secret Rare right there. Absolutely gangster. Keep it going. We're doing pretty dang good now. Now I'm back excited. For a while there, I was getting nervous. We didn't have we didn't have a ton of stuff on the last couple of packs. We get that. See, it's like you get just get like energized after getting a good pull. So let's hopefully we can, like I said, get probably, I don't know, if we can get, what did I say, two? I already got two, so we're doing three. We're doing pretty dang good. So hopefully, like I said, we can just keep getting a couple more, keep getting hits. Reverse Larvitar, Reverse Kilowattrol, and a Tinglu EX. Wow, that is a massive pull. Super pumped about that. We'll put that right there on top of the belly bolt. We got four great pulls right now. Wow, we still got quite a few left. Dang. This boost box, man, I'm telling you, go check out that previous video if you didn't watch it. I was, like, so excited the first pack I opened, pulling a secret rare that I actually couldn't even, like, talk. I couldn't even think of words. I was so excited. I was not expecting that. And here we are, still getting great pulls. I am absolutely pumped. Cerule Edge Reverse, Mabustiff Reverse, and a High, Dra high Drygon Regular Rare. Jeez, one of these days I'll be able to speak English properly <laughs> but so far we're not doing too good in these videos if only you guys saw how many takes it takes to make one intro to one of these videos or an outro it takes like 75 use up half the <laughs> half the battery life on my uh camera but um yeah and then you get into these where it's like one shot done like if i mess up a word and i open up a pack what am I, I can't go back in time but yeah volturb voltorb reverse dino reverse and a mimic you regular rare first time we've got that so getting quite a few of the set numbers down as well which is pretty awesome like i said i'm probably not going to go as crazy getting 100 packs on this set i might try and like switch it up uh and see how many we can get just getting eggs what am i getting i got a booster box an etb two check lane blisters three pack check lane blisters a single check pack a single check lane blisters and two one of each of the two legendary tins so we'll see how many cards that is but Bax caliber regular rare right there so however many packs that is quick math i'll throw it up on the screen because i'm focused on doing this right now but i'll probably stop after that unless i can get another good deal or i have like really good luck with this booster box on these last couple sets because then maybe i'll call this dude up pick up another set from him and um yeah, hopefully we get just as lucky as we are so far. But like I said, I don't know. I don't want to go too crazy because I feel like I could just kind of get rid of the duplicates and Sneasel and the Oricoro right there. Like I said, I don't want to get too crazy because having a ton of duplicates is just kind of a bummer. And I don't really know what to do with them because there's only so many people out there that need regulars and commons and stuff like that and reverse hollows and stuff like that. So I don't want to get too, too carried away like I did last time. But last time wasn't really planned out like that. It's just... Things fell in my lap, and I just took advantage of deals and situations and stuff like that. Quaxley Reverse, Chien Pao, Ultra Rare, or Hyper Rare, I mean, wow. Wow, that is an insanely good pull in a Weevil to end it off right there. But holy, wow. 
We got the Chen Pao in the previous video. Like I said, if you haven't checked that out, go ahead, check that out. But a hyper rare right there. We're going to put that front and center right there. Absolutely gangster pull. Pumped about that one. Hopefully, the last two packs, we can get a little bit of luck continued and see what we can get out of these. Okay, oh no. We got a knuckle stack. Calamitous Mountain, Snowy Mountain, and a Mouse Hold Special Illustration. Or no, just an Illustration Rare. Illustration Rare. One gold star. Wow. We are absolutely killed. Oh, and we got a Fortress EX Ultra Rare right there. Wow. We are absolutely killing it in this pack. Wow. We got one more pack. Holy crap. That is the first time I have pulled a double hit like that ever and i've opened up now 136 packs between the two sets wow i am absolutely speechless hold on let's take a pause here the artwork on this is fantastic look at that artwork wow i can't believe we are killing it hopefully last pack we get some last pack luck right here and we'll see exactly how good we do but so far Seven hits today. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven hits. Six in the previous video. We are absolutely killing it here. I am so pumped. Hopefully, even if we don't get anything on this, I am absolutely ecstatic with this booster box. Love disc and a Tinkaton regular rare. We don't have this one, and this is one of, I keep saying this. I've said this about everybody. Tinkaton, definitely one of my top five favorite on this new generation of Pokemon. But holy crap, we did absolutely fantastic with our pulls today the icing on the cake is definitely the chien pao hyper rare right there the gold cards always super exciting to get those but let's get these things organized get all of these cards wrapped up all right and just like that we're all wrapped up opening up the rest of this Paldea evolved booster box now, i had all the pulls from yesterday's video on hand so i decided to take those out and lay everything out together so you guys can see all 13 pulls we got from this single booster box now i'm absolutely ecstatic with this pull rate i feel like i'm already doing better with Paldea evolved than i did with scarlet and violet base set after i opened up that booster box so like i said i'm absolutely ecstatic with this pull rate now all in all in total we got five double rares three ultra rares Three illustration rares, a single special illustration rare, and last but not least, a single hyper rare. Like I said, guys, cannot stress this enough. I'm absolutely ecstatic with this pull rate. Do me a favor, comment down below what you guys think is your favorite from this pull, or at least the most valuable or best card that I pulled in today's video. As far as artwork goes, the Heracross and Mousehold are absolute favorites, but as far as rarity goes, the Chien Pao Hyper Rare is obviously on top. That's all we have for today's video. I have a ton more Paldea Evolve stuff being delivered next week, so stay tuned for those videos. Subscribe to the channel, like this video, but for now, peace out, and I'll catch you on the next one.